so close now. Oh. Your quiver. Strap broke when we fought the dragon. It's all right. I can hold it. Stop. Broken quiver will slow your draw. Pain we endure. Faulty weaponry we do not. This will do for now. Good? Good. Hmm. Go. Steady, boy. Mind your footing. Focus up, boy! حبيبي والله هلا هلا وعليكم السلام ويلكم يا صديقي حبيبي والله تسلم تسلم حياك من دمج من دمج هذا ايش في معلق الكاميرا ذاتني لي متى كله تعلق خلاص وايد تعلق الكاميرا عندي وين ايش السالفه تو ماتش تعليقه ويلكم هلا هلا اول اول شوف اول هناك البيت There must be some way up. You hear those voices too, right? Yes, be silent. Fuck some last. You know why we're here. My last visit managed to loosen your tongue. That sounds like the same man who came to our house. You said you killed him. Shh. I see you brought company this time. Must be important if the sons of Thor deign to grace me with their presence. Tell me, you two still tripping over yourselves to impress Daddy? The tattooed man. Tracks show he now travels with a child. Where would they go next? Why would I know that? You're the smartest man alive, aren't you? Smarter than all the dead ones, too. You help me, I help you. Tell me where they are, and I'll talk to Odin. 
Your father won't let me go, Balder, and he won't let you kill me. You have nothing to offer me, so take your questions, take your threats, take these two worthless wankers, and piss off! Oh. And no one's looking. We'll be back for your other eye. Don't you forget. We really are. We really Off. are, aren't we? Off! Off! Balder, he is the one of the Asir, Odin's son, Thor's brother. He came to our house and fought father, and father killed him. Or so, we both thought. Supposedly, he can't feel pain, and now he's hunting us with his nephews, but we don't know why. Off. خلدين شنو هذا Ah the very topic of conversation a tattooed man traveling with a child Boy well, we took their path make sure we are alone But we just saw them leave Do as I say He doesn't know what you are and I would keep it that way. Who are you? Me? I'm the greatest ambassador to the gods, the giants, and all the creatures of the Nine Realms. I know every corner of these lands, every language spoken, every war waged, every deal struck. They call me Mimir, smartest man alive. And I have the answer to your every question. Why does the son of Odin hunt us? Okay, there are a few gaps in my knowledge. <laughs> but Odin's had me imprisoned here for 109 winters. I'm a clever lad. I can piece it together. I promise. Just give him time. Nobody there, just like I said. The boy's mother is dead. She wished her. She wanted us to spread her ashes on the highest peak in all the realms. Oh, then you've come to the wrong place, little brother. The highest peak in all the realms is not here in Midgard. It's in Jotunheim, realm of the giants. No! That could not be what she meant. Take a look. This is the last known bridge to Jotunheim in all the realms. See that mountain? Looks like a giant's finger scraping the sky. That's the highest peak in all the realms. No here. Can't we just take that bridge? We have a Bifrost. When the Giants destroyed all other bridges to their realm, they locked this one up with a secret rune. If it still exists, only a Giant would know it. And all of them left Midgard a long time ago. True. But today, the winds of fate have kicked up a strange vortex of coincidence. Fact is, there's only one person alive who can get you where you need to go. And luckily for you, my schedule's wide open. We're going to Jotunheim, right? It's your best and only move from a tactical standpoint. It's the one place the man who cannot be killed won't follow you. What do we do? Yes! First, you need to cut off my head. Wait, what? Odin made sure that no weapon, not even Thor's hammer, could free my body from these bonds. But fortunately, you don't need my body. The trick is, we need to find someone who can reanimate my head using the old magic. Old magic? Mm. There's a witch of the woods. She knows the old ways. And she'll help. She might do what a try. But if she fails, he will be dead. He tortures me, you know. Every day, brother. Wouldn't himself sees to it personally, and believe me, there is no end to his creativity. Every single day. This... This isn't living. Very well. Oh, I can't watch this. Mother. In case you can't resurrect me, there's something you need to know. 
boy. The longer you wait to tell him his true nature, the more damage you do. He will resent you, and you may lose him forever. There is much about me I would not have him know. Huh? So you value your privacy more than your son? I'm going to cut off your head now. Fair enough. Yuna! We're going to Yuna! We're going to find the long-lost realm of the giants. That's... that's... Inconvenient. Yeah, that's just what I was going to say. Uh, select the take a screenshot. <laughs> oh, mm. Remember the way to the witch's house? Yes. The woods with the blood red leaves. South of the lake. I know just where to go. Hope she made it back from Alfheim and can bring Lemire back. He seemed nice. Before you cut off his head. Ah. I cannot travel to this yet. Look at this place. This must be a branch of the world tree. Boy, stay on the path. Right, right, I know. I can't believe it was Balder that came to our house. The Acer God. Balder! And you fought him! And won! Yes. One of Odin's sons, Thor's brother. And now he's hunting us with his nephews. Why is this happening? If we can raise the head, you can ask him. Okay. 
You know, it's silly, but I secretly hope we find a giant somewhere in that mountain. I guess they really did leave Midgard, except for the serpent. He may be the last of his kind. Are you the last of your kind too? Is that why you don't like to talk about my the... kind? I mean, your family, before mother and I, where you came from, mother, a father. Now is not the time for that. Yes, sir. <laughs> Whoa. Fucking break! Don't hear me screeching at you whenever you're twiddling your short and curlies. <laughs> boy. No, Fab. Well, you already soiled my solitude, so you may as well join me. You're not hungry. Good. It's not what I was offering. Saw your brother again. Congratulations. And I'm sure you'll let him go and roger my axe good and plenty again, hmm? Let's see the damage. Mm, little canker throat wouldn't know proper weight and balance if it were dangling off his chut. Hmm. Is he eating well enough? I guess. Good. All better. Now what the fuck else you want, huh? <laughs> Times uh. he gets so wrapped up in his work, Sentry has it the sense to sip or suck. <laughs> and if he does remember, good luck getting him to cook his own meat. Guess I got all the stomach in the family. <laughs> Along with the smarts. You miss him. What, that spit fister? What do you know? I just mean hey, that... Hey, do you mind? Trying to concentrate here, already on a break from my break. Hey, where's your beast of burden? What do you mean? I ate her. Fat bits of her out just a while ago. What is wrong with you? What? Her milk ran dry. She was your friend. Then she'll be happy I'm so well fed. Shit bricks, boy, you got a real sentimental streak, know that? Don't get yourself confused out there. I'm getting back to it. To work it is. And for Junior? What next? We got that taken care of. Something on your mind, boy? Another time, then. Boy, what is the path back to the witch? First, we need to find a boat. Statue of Thor. Port? Sorry? 
Port. Oh, the boat's left. Correct. She's really powerful, but you really think the witch can bring the head back to life? She seems competent in her craft, and we have nothing to lose. If she can't bring it back to life, can we keep the head? No. <laughs> but you may feed it to the fish. Okay.
I bet this will lead out. Atreus, follow me. Boy, over here. Another map. Bet we'll find something useful here. It's locked magically. I think I see another one of those bowls of sand up there. That I drew the runes into? Not sure how we reach it. I see something up there. Up there! 
Boy. Yes, sir. Almost there. Sandbowls. Bow. Someone. Bullets. Turn back Aesir. Guess the gods aren't welcome here. <gasps> there he is! I hope he remembers us.
I'll scout ahead. How's it going, Charlie? Is there a witch friend here? What is that name? That's what he told me it was. Or what it sounded like in my head, anyway. Charlie. What does it say? Sir! Death to the Raven God, Lord of the Hang. She really doesn't like Odin very much. <laughs> Another one of those sandals. What does it say? Falcon, hawk, and turtle dove. Some aloft in oceans above. Huh? spell anything it's gibberish want me to read this one those runes on the rock they don't spell anything it's gibberish She is here. It is so good to see you again. I knew you weren't dead. <laughs> Hello. Oh, can you bring a head back to life? Uh, I'm not sure I understand what... Wait. Where did you get those? The arrows. Give them to me. Now. They were a gift. Do as she says, boy. These arrows are dangerous. They're wicked. You find any more, you destroy them, understand? Do you understand? Say it! I understand. If I see them, I'll destroy them. It's all I ask. Forgive me. Please, take my arrows in their place. I have no need for them anymore. What's this about a head? Do you have any idea who this is? Did you kill him? At his request. He claimed you could revive him. Me? Are you sure you heard him right? 
please? <laughs> Take him to the table. Pamela. It's been a long time since I've practiced the old magic. Hold him there. Let's have a look. Well, thankfully his head hasn't decayed much and his brain is still intact. Nice clean cut. Cutting off his head of all people. I sure hope you know what you're doing. Now hold his head under the water and don't let go. I mean it. That's enough. It worked! Let me see him. Mamir, you there? Yes. Good. Oh. Ah! Hello, Freya. Been a long time. You look well. What I did, I did for them. As far as I'm concerned, death suits you better. I'd bow if I could, Your Majesty. Forgive me. <laughs> Had I known the witch in the woods was Freya herself, I never would have suggested this. Freya? The goddess Freya? You didn't know either. Sorry. When word gets out that Mimir is free, the wrath of Odin won't be far behind. You are God. Leader of the Vanir, once yes, but no longer. You did not think it important to tell me. Are you really going to lecture me about that? <laughs> we are leaving, boy. But now. You're welcome. Why did you do that? We cannot trust her. Because she's a god? Have I taught you nothing, boy? But she's helped us a lot. She lied. Some people value the privacy. Best not to judge, brother. When I require your counsel head, I will ask. Fair enough. Get me to Tyr's temple in the Lake of the Nine, and I'll get you to Jotunheim as promised. We know the temple. What's there? Only the last living giant in Midgard. Who better to tell us the way? The World Serpent? Wait, do you know how to talk to him? Indeed. He speaks an obscure tongue more ancient even than these mountains. None are left in Midgard who speak it. Except, of course, for me. You do? It's true. You wouldn't know it to look at him, but Jormungandr is a sparkling conversationalist. خسي لما نطق الطوفة نرجع لسؤالي 
هلا بلاك انا تقول لي بس لك بعدين تمشي وبعد افتر 6 اورز ترجع مره ثانيه ويلكم باك خاسي سمير Why did Frey spin your face? No. Speak of Balder. He claims nothing harms him. Die. I'm dying. Ah, I'm like, dead. The whole thing. Oh, Grandpa. The monkey. Hello, hello, Grandpa. Hello. Welcome. All the Grandpa. We met in the night. من متى؟ ويلكم ويلكم حياك حياك شلونك شو اخبارك؟ بالدر از بلست وذ انفولنرابيلتي تو اول ثريتس فيزيكال اور ماجيكال بوستينغ اوف ا جاد ايفري ون هاز ا ويكنس نوت هيم ام افريد بالدر از بلست وذ انفولنرابيلتي تو اول ثريتس فيزيكال اور ماجيكال يو جست سيد ذات نمير ديد اي وات از ذا سورس اوف ذيس باور Well, as I recall, it involved uh, a spell? Mamir? Parts of my brain must still be coming back to life. Just need a moment to finish waking up. <laughs> Hope he's not broken. Ah. Hey, Allah yain, Allah. Bas, انتقلت وسالفة بعد. Allah yainik. بس ما عايش في سلام يوم شفت اخبار بس اي أيوة والله شيء ضيق الخلق الصراحه بس يلا الحمد لله الحمد لله الامور ان شاء الله تتيسر نمير فرن ذا ليك بيرفكت دوكس نير ذا بريدج Never did tell me why Freya spit in your face. Well, she blames me in large measure for her present circumstances, and not totally without reason. It all goes back to the long war between the Aesir and Vanir. Prior to that, wars for the Aesir were easily won, but the Vanir had proved their equal and exacted devastating damage. Both sides suffered tremendous losses, and for many of us, quite frankly, war was simply no fun anymore. But a rather senseless waste of precious life. Wouldn't you agree, brother? <clears throat> Precisely. Enough was enough. And at last, Odin's most brilliant advisor became determined to find a more enlightened path. He set about to broker a peace between the gods. It took some convincing, but ultimately Odin was persuaded to marry his deadliest enemy, a certain Vanir goddess, legendary not only for her fertile beauty, But her genius at the very Vanir magic that Odin had long aspired to master. Freya married Odin? What was in it for her? It was a sacrifice to protect her people. A selfless act of love. Truly, she deserves better than she got. But of course, there's more to that story. Here, boy. Yes, sir. There's another one of those maps. Down. 
مثلا ما شفنا بلاك بيرلي بفترة ايه انا الحين قاعد اسوي اشياء مثل كم شغلة شغلة كواك اوه هذا اماكن انها اماكن سورية وكيف اخطرها Atreus to me. أه مثلا أه ما احب اقول بي بثك تعرف ليش ليش انت هذا سؤال ولا قاعد تقول اني انا اعرف Challenges mean nothing to the gods, spirit. They do not listen. Do not mock my pursuit of vengeance. <laughs> Though my family devoted their lives to worshiping Thor, I've devoted mine to his downfall. And I will start with that statue looming over my father's grave. Unlikely. You are dead. Is there something we can do? For a reward, of course. If you bring down the statue, you have my blessing to loot my father's grave. He rests on an island to the east. Why do you hate Thor so much? After my father passed, my mother built the statue to watch over his grave. Imagine our surprise when the God of Thunder himself came to offer condolences. At first we were thrilled, but he quickly took advantage of our hospitality. My mother begged him to leave, and Thor, in his drunken rage, killed her. I was left with nothing but grief. Eventually I lost that as well, and found only rage in its place. I... I'm so sorry. Come, boy. We have a statue to destroy. La black sadi. Ya sadiq and moon ala baal.
واو اكتب immediately after being hit recover faster also has a faster effect that increase the timing window on parries كفو والله بالعكس فاهم عليك يا صديقي فاهم نادر ما يكون في ناس يفكرون نفسك My father's grave lies on an island to the east Do not mistake my mother's statue of Thor with that monstrous eyesore to the south His mom was killed by Thor? What about him? Let his story be a reminder. The lives of men mean nothing to the gods. I know, Father. You know. But do you listen? Yes. <laughs> Good. Well, what's your father went east? Island on the east. Okay. I can't believe Odin and Freya were ever married. Love and hate are more closely intertwined than you might imagine. For instance, Odin hates the giants and they him. But Thor's own mother was the giantess Fjorgun, one of Odin's great loves. So Thor's half god and half giant? Where? Once Fjorgun was gone, lonely ages passed for Odin. And as war with the Vanir raged, I could see what he really wanted beneath his bluster. And after no small amount of convincing, Freya agreed. For a while there, he really turned on the charm. He seemed happy. He seemed interested in making her happy. He granted her so many wishes, I can scarcely recall them all. The peace held, and I truly believed all had worked out better than I could have planned. But Odin's true face showed itself again in the end. Oh, he won Freya's trust, and she taught him some of her Vanir magic, another choice she would live to bitterly regret. Sadly, Despite his wise counselor's best efforts to persuade him that peace was the only true path to stave off Ragnarok, Odin never let go of his obsession with Jotunheim. The taste of Vanir magic led him to new forms of experimentation and new levels of depravity. Boy. Vathergar. Southern <laughs> outposts of the Dwarven King. Dwarven King? Have you ever heard of a Dwarven King? No. I'd heard rumors of a powerful dwarf ruling over some poor sods not far from here. Not that you asked me. Almost forgot. Brock, this is our new friend Mimir. We've, We've met. met. Oh, why didn't you say so? He, he knows, knows why. why. I, I know, know why. why. You know you why. Know 
want. Quiet. No more of this. <laughs> you know what? I'm sorry I brought it up. Hey, Brock. You ever hear of a Dwarf King? I suppose you're talking about Motsignir? Some bitch ruled over the humans once lived in this area. Built itself a castle just north of here. A dwarven castle? What's it like? You got yourself a pair of eyes and legs, ain't you? Huh? Might want to stock up before you head that way, though. Old Motsignir's known for collecting all manner of killerin' creatures. Not sure who's looking after them now. Can't you and Sindri just patch things up? Whatever happened couldn't be all that bad. Your family. Now don't be lecturing me about family. I ain't the one what forgot what her name stood for. What we made, the weapons we made were legendary across nine realms for more years than I can count. You just don't throw that away on account of one bad... One bad what? You One bad nothing. Ain't you got somewhere to be? To work it is. What you need, kid? What'd you forget? Later then. Yalla, bilafia.
What happened to these people? Follow the clues. Okay. Well, scorch marks. They're all grouped together. So maybe they were hiding from some kind of fire breather. But they died anyways. <laughs> Harani. Curse the Dwarf King, bane of mankind. Sounds like he wasn't a very good king. I wonder why they hated him so much. They are dead now. Does it matter? Nah, I'm just curious. Curiosity is dangerous, boy. Stay focused. to build statues this big. Doors are resourceful creatures. Annoying, but resourceful. I guess they must have been pretty important dwarves. That sounds like a dragon. Dragonzani. the improvement. chained up too over there Atreus to me
Wow. There's a Thor statue on that island. That must be where the spirit's father is buried. 